ICT means to me is, for most modern companies, I feel like it's the backbone of their operations. It's pervasive in everything we do. The reason I'm in ICT, because I, I grew up with it, I think the first computer system I had was a VIC-20 many years ago. We we're always playing games, programming, things like that. My oldest brother uh, went into computer science ahead of me, so basically I was following in his footsteps, building computers, destroying computers, pretty much everything. Going into IT and ICT was really the, the next step. I feel like some of the misconceptions of ICT might be that there's a lot of stereotypes about the people working it. I think a lot of people hear IT person and they get this instant image in their head of what that person looks like. ICT in general is a lot more broad than that. There's a lot of marketing these days. There's a lot of obviously graphic design. I, I think there's definitely room for um, everybody. I think a lot of the changes are, it's just, ICT covers a lot more disciplines. It used to be just programmers and server people and even marketing people, it was a lot of paper-based and now it's all technical. Well, a lot of it's online, internet, Facebook, and it makes it more interesting for everybody. iDream Interactive was founded in 2006 by uh, Jacob Duhame, the CEO. He started out with one employee at his kitchen table at his home, and quickly thereafter it grew to six employees, at which they moved into his basement. In 2011, I came on full time as to be CTO, and uh, since then we've published seven games onto mobile and Facebook. In the last uh, six months, we've basically doubled our team. Yeah, the future's pretty bright for us so far. My name is Chris Marin. I am the lead client developer at iDream Interactive. I've been here for nearly a decade now. Starting from a very young age, anything with wires or buttons absolutely fascinated me. Anytime there was a computer class or anything even remotely technology related, I would take those classes. Just a deep love of technology kept building and building and building. My favorite project that I've worked on thus far uh, has to be Recipe Rescue because Recipe Rescue is the first game that I was the lead on. And to watch something grow from just a few lines of code to literally thousands of files to a game that's been played by two million players has been a really, really enjoyable experience and uh, something I'm definitely very proud of. To work in ICT, I feel like you really have to have great problem solving skills. You need to have very good communication, which I think is contrary to what some people might believe when they think of an IT person. Communication skills are key. We've had people that we've even recommend go and take speech classes, getting comfortable in your own skin, being able to talk to another person, being able to accept and give criticism without perceiving it as an attack, and being able to take that feedback and build upon it in a positive way is very important. When we look to hire somebody, we usually go to a job site online. We work with the university, there's a master's program that we work with to get candidates as well, or just word of mouth. The fantastic thing about this company for me is that it was based in Windsor. I was born and raised in this city. I love this city. It's the perfect size for me. It's exactly everything about this city I love. So for me to have a company like iDream where I could do what I've wanted to do since day one has been absolutely incredible. I've seen it grow from literally five people in his basement to a team of 13 in our own office space. It's been an incredible journey and I'm so very thankful that the tech community seems to be growing in Windsor so that other people can lead the same life that I've been able to. Uh -huh.